All right, Coach, uh, first of all, uh, congratulations on another win. Thank you. Uh, very, very impressive one tonight. Um, and we talked earlier this week about you know, how you guys wanted to really focus on tonight's match, and it was obvious that you guys were <laughs> we focused did, yeah. and ready for this one. Yeah. Um, you know, a lot of uh, compliments, you know, to the team on, you know, not looking ahead to uh, SFA, which is not the easiest thing to do, like we talked about earlier in the week. Um, but, yeah, I mean, they, they took the scout. They, they knew exactly what they needed to do. Um, and, and the things that, you know, ACU can do well, I mean, they're, they're awesome at. And so for us to be able to take it away defensively and then churn those things out in transition into points is, is a great job. And I think it also helps a little bit when uh, Hannah comes out and, and does what she did, mm -hmm. especially in that first set, uh, 11 kills, and really, I think, kind of set the tone for uh, the rest of the night. Yeah, I mean, I, I think the technical term is it was bonkers. I mean, it, it was ridiculous. What was it, 11 kills in the first set? I mean, it's just, it's crazy numbers, and just it was an impressive night, and I'm happy for her. Uh, and, you know, another part of it, and we've talked about it several times throughout the year, was, you know, when... When Hannah's doing her thing, you still need that second, third mm -hmm. option tonight. D had a really good uh, night. Courtney again yeah. coming through uh, when uh, when some of the other girls were not on their regular, uh, I guess, swings. As, as she said. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, clearly, you know, Courtney and and D had great nights offensively. Um, you know, Courtney did some really, you know, good things with the ball, and D had some some kills that were incredibly aggressive, and then some also some ones that were really smart. Um, and, you know, in Lex, I thought, you know, we, we gave her the task of being matched up with their best block. And it was a little bit slow to start. And then she started to do some really good stuff with the ball and started to score late, which really allowed us to, you know, to put the match away. Eight wins in a row now. Mm -hmm. Ties the record for longest winning streak uh, at, at Northwestern. So, I mean, that's just that in itself is has got to be a good feeling yeah i mean it, it's we got a great thing going right now um you know the girls are playing great together um yeah we, we're happy with the way things are going so now we've moved past thursday uh we can talk a little bit about saturday mm -hmm. just how big is that match um yeah i mean it's a big match anytime you play you know the team that's ranked number one in the conference it's huge um i think we have a great opportunity to give them a great match and and put ourselves in a position to be able to you know, to give them that first loss. Um, they do a ton of different things really well. Uh, so it's not going to be easy, but, you know, the way we're playing right now, I think we can take anybody. Yeah, and we talked about earlier the confidence level of the team. It was at a really high spot. I think maybe tonight, maybe even a little bit higher after the way they play. Yeah, I mean, tonight's definitely a little turbo boost into Saturday. All right, Coach, we well, appreciate you again. Congratulations, and we'll talk to you again after a Saturday's match. All right, thanks.